You're looking at a robotic laundry folding machine. No! Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> Come on, admit it. There's a little man inside there doing all the work. No, little man, no. <laughs> okay, so how much is getting a robot to do my laundry for me going to cost me? So the target price at the moment is 980 US dollars. We're trying to keep the price down because we really want as many people to afford it as possible. Well, particularly people who don't want to do their own laundry. Now, it folds, but does it wash? It doesn't wash, no, it just folds. Okay, so I still have to do some work. So how does it work? Um, it's really simple. You literally just clip each item in, and every few seconds you can just clip the an, another item. Um, the drawer is filling up. The, it's actually folding simultaneously, so there are multiple items inside folding at the same time. The drawer fills up. When the drawer is full, it tells you. You take them out, and then you just continue. So how long did it take for you to come up with this technology? Because clearly we've been folding laundry way too long. Well, in actual fact, the founder and the CEO uh, came up with the idea of a laundry folding machine about seven years ago. However, he was trying all sorts of different ideas. And a year and a half ago, he decided that he was going to make a website and a video and see how much interest there was. And we released the website uh, in June 2016. It went totally viral. And then we realized how many people in the world really hate folding their laundry. I think every single person in the world. I'm not sure every single person. Actually, there are a few people that actually love folding. Yes, but they are sick, sick individuals, and we're not talking about them. <laughs> Maybe. But most people hate folding laundry. And how long is it going to be before I can walk into a Home Depot and pick up one of these types of things? Okay, so the first the, the target shipment, the first target shipment um, is estimated at the end of 2019. That is an awful long time to wait. Do you know how much laundry that I'm going to have to do between now and then? You just have to be a little bit more patient. <laughs> What is the secret behind it? Because I have a heck of a time folding certain types of unmentionables when I am doing the family laundry. How does this know how to fold everything? Okay, so first of all, it doesn't fold everything. It won't fold... You're starting to lose me. <laughs> Sorry. It won't fold sheets. It won't fold large items. You can see it won't cope with fold out. So it's not going to fold a fitted sheet, the one thing I definitely can't do? No, sorry. It won't. Not at the moment. Maybe. That's version 2.0. Maybe, maybe three or something, but not at the moment. And it won't fold really small items. It won't fold underwear, socks, baby clothes. Um, it'll. We are, well, the target is that it'll fold between um, age five and extra large. So again, by the end of 2019, that's when I'm going to be able to stop folding laundry forever. Um, I hope so, yes. <laughs> With the exception of the baby clothes and the unmentionables and the fitted sheets, I'll have to wait until, what, 2020 for version two for that. I don't know if you will wait for 2020 for version 2, but eventually we'll get there, yeah. <laughs>